right, all right. Coming in, Bryce Vine on the Adam Bomb Show. Two award shows in a row, man. This is exciting. Man, we're I'll, just killing it. And right I love now. our shirts. It's very animalish. I got a French Bulldog. You got a. Is that a Pelican? I, that was the first thing I was going to say to you is that I want it, and I'll switch with you right here on camera if you want. <laughs> Never done before. In an Never done. Oh, man. So you go, we're coming into Atlanta for a couple of things. Obviously, Qtopia Fest on Friday, dude. Hell I'm yeah. excited. How excited are you when you just get to perform? I mean, you don't need to do all of this. You don't need to be in a studio. You just got to let loose and do your thing. To be honest with you, this isn't so bad either. Okay, just like yeah. Sitting and talking to people about yourself for five minutes. Yeah, right. You know what I mean, I feel like most people like to do that anyway. Yeah. But the shows are what I live for, you know? Yeah. That's the energy that you want. It's like to just connect with people on that level is the best. Yeah. Uh, Bryce Vine on the Adam Bomb Show. Let's just real quick talk about how much Drew Barrymore has exploded. It was like the train that just yeah. kept going and going, and now bam. For yeah, you, man. though, did you expect that, or were you kind of like, I don't know, is this the one? Because it's been the one, I think. I mean, I just write songs and hope that the, I mean, I, if I finish a song, it's because I think it's really good. Yeah, yeah. You know, so that's what I focus on. Is it a good right. song? Then hopefully people will think so, too. Yeah, man. Bryce Vines on the Atom Bomb Show. Let's talk about Halloween, man. What are you going to be for Halloween? <laughs> In Chicago, playing a show. But I don't know. <laughs> so I think you're, you're going to be wearing warm clothes, I guess, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah, I'm going to be. I'm going to be not frozen. Hopefully yeah, right. For hot. I don't know. Last year, I was a ceiling fan. What is a ceiling fan costume? It's where you put on a shirt and it says "Go ceiling." <laughs> yeah, that was my costume. Okay, that's good. All right. Well. <laughs> On yeah, that sorry note. about that. No, 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 no. No, that's the best costume. I don't even like everybody gets these big costumes and spends all this money. All we got to do is put shirts. I, and then one year I had a show on Halloween and I wore a Batman onesie. And I had nothing on underneath it. Oh, dang! <laughs> it was so disgusting. That's, that, yeah, that probably I is disgusting. Right? Yeah. Show, yeah. Well, I'm going to be a Bryce Vine fan this Friday at Qtopia Fest, man. I'm excited to have you in. Dude. Thank it's you, gonna man. Be good. Me too. Uh, do we? Do you have? What's your next single? Have you hit that yet? Uh, it looks like it's going to be this song called La La Land. Okay. Tell me yeah. a little bit about that here before we go. Uh, I wrote it, I guess, last summer with one of my friends who also helped write Drew Barrymore. And um, it's just kind of about Los Angeles in general. It's like, from my point of view, of yeah. what it's like and like the people that you meet and the conversations that you have. But it's just like a, it's a pretty fun song. Yeah, that's awesome. Can't wait to hear that. Bryce yeah. Vine. We'll hear it on Friday, probably, at Qtopia Fest on the Atom Bomb Show. It's possible. I don't know. Cause you're the next Drew Barry. And I want more. Yeah. And all these other girls keep wanting.